Yeah, I just wanted to show you a quick video of uh, an easy way to uh, protect or like seal your uh, CNC router inside without making a mess. So I bought this uh, Shaboko router uh, a couple weeks ago and I was like, well, crap, how am I gonna keep this from getting making a mess? Uh, so my building is kind of like a uh, half basketball court, half like 3D printing and other things. And uh, I really needed to keep the, the sawdust and everything from getting inside the little holes in the tiles and things like that. So I ordered this, uh, what this is, is a soccer, you know, like one of those soccer mom deals where you like for weather protection and I turned it on its side. So it has a zipper. So when I'm actually, you know, going to do something here, like I just zip the whole thing up and then I just stick the cords out the bottom there. And so the whole thing just runs inside. You can see I ran, uh, I ran a job in there and uh, all the dust and stuff just kind of see on the inside I got just a little bit where I uh, unzipped it there but other than that it's all stayed inside there and did pretty good so hopefully this gives you a good idea I don't know if this is the, the greatest idea but uh, this is what I did as a cheap easy way to uh, enclose my uh, CNC I'll probably do something more permanent later but for right now this is what I've got going hope this helps thanks